Keysight Technologies. We're here at the Automotive Customer Center located in Novi, Michigan. My name is Jital, and today I'm going to show you how we can use an Infinium S-Series oscilloscope, a waveform generator, and a Keysight specialized test fixture to perform an automotive ethernet transmitter test with distortion. In this setup, we're using a Texas Instruments 100 base T1 board as our device under test. It is transmitting at about 66 megabits per second. According to the standard, we must distort with one-sixth of the frequency of the transmitted signal, so we output an 11 megahertz signal from the waveform generator. That signal couples with and distorts the signal from the TI board. The test picture simplifies the connection of our components. Then we use the oscilloscope to measure the distortion at each phase. Using the AE6910T test application, we set up and calibrated in the setup menu. Then we chose our test mode in the select tests menu. Then in the configure menu, we chose compliance mode. And finally, in the connect menu, we made our connections using the reference schematics and ran the test. Looking at the results, we observed that the maximum distortion at any phase was about 10.5 millivolts. In order to be in compliance with the standard, the maximum distortion must be under 15 millivolts, so this test passed. The test app also generates a test report which gives a summary of the results along with trials and result details. The Keysight test application supports 100 base T1, 1000 base T1, and future standards. Keysight also has a specialized fixture board with various adapters for automotive ethernet connectors. We also provide link segment testing and receiver testing. To contact Keysight about product selection assistance, education, or training, call 1-800-829-4444 or visit us at keysight.com. Thank you.